students will be heading to school a week from today. Some teachers are already hard at work preparing for the start of classes. The Escanaba High School building will see 1140 students this year. That's in the high school and the new junior high section. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Yona Gavino shows us what's being done during the final week of summer vacation. Its new name is Escanaba Senior High School and Escanaba Junior High School. The junior high will consist of grades 7 and 8. The halls are empty right now, but classrooms were busy as teachers unpacked. But it's busy, but it's exciting because now we're doing things like working on school improvement goals, working on curriculum things and the things we should be working on, not worried about what room are, am I going to teach in, what temporary place am I going to be, what construction wall are we putting up by Tuesday. That construction is now complete. What you see now are improvements that benefit everyone. We've upgraded three computer labs. We've also put in iPad, three iPad carts around the building that teachers can check out and use with their classes. We also have a document camera and a, a short throw data projector in every classroom. The expansion and new additions cost just over $22 million. Escanaba School Superintendent Michelle Amir says the high school alone has $19 million worth of improvements. So every building I think will have a different mindset where they'll, they'll be working on that to try and make it their own. That's the goal for this year. Big junky closet full of stuff. The school will host a business after hours on the first Wednesday of November. It'll be an open house for the whole community and a chance to thank them for their support. Yona Gavino, TV6 News, Escanaba.